yeah, so, um, yeah, I went all Britney on you guys. Anyway, what's up, guys? Today we've got a brand new video, and as you can tell by the title, it's actually going to be a shoe review. Feeling a bit hungover today, and uh, I've already been out to Oxford Circus to go to Pata to actually get these shoes. So I just thought, you know what? So I've only seen the shoes in the shop. I haven't actually got them out of the box yet. So this is all new to me. I don't even know whether they're the right size or anything. I didn't check. So it comes in your standard ASIC box. I've seen a few at the minute that like the new grey boxes, which I do actually like quite a lot more. I don't know why, but eh, it's like the traditional box. As far as I've got ASICs, this is the box it's been in or something similar. Shit. So yeah, no special packaging, just your standard A6 box. Nothing special inside. I think I only got stickers from Patty because I asked for the receipt and I wanted some. So, oh my, they're a lot lighter than I thought. So, here's the shoe. Pow! Oh god, it smells so nice. Mm. Mm. Now I completely understand if you don't like these, I think the colour's a bit of a funny one that a lot of people might not like. The brown and like a dusty pink. Uh, but you've got some good materials on here. Um, you've got like a nice, I don't know, it's really soft suede around the cage. You've got some 3M hits around here. You've got a nice leather tab on the back. They're a very obscure model. They're, they're a lot lighter than I thought as well. Um, they feel really nice though. Like, very cool. So from my understanding, these used to be a trail shoe. Um, and I do think they look like rock climbing shoes or something like that. So. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that's the sort of thing it looks like. So as you can see on the knit on the top, under the cage it actually says patter on that side and the same on that side. And then it's got a little pattern on the back, again with the 3M and like I said, the leather. Did it say A6 on the back or something? You get two pairs of spare laces, both rope laces because these are just look fucking stupid with flats in them. If you put flats in them somehow, um, yeah. That'd just be crazy. They're laced in a very interesting way where it actually comes around the back and through there. I actually do fucking really like that. So I don't know whether if you want to relace them, you have to do all that, but I'm not going to. Nice colors though. So yeah, they're just a really, really obscure shoe. There's not that much to say about them. That's pretty much it. Interesting. One thing I gotta mention about this shoe is that the retail is fucking too high. Uh, it's too expensive. I wanted to get them because I wasn't sure how people were standing with them and I thought they'd be quite an easy cop, which they were. So considering you don't get anything special, you don't get a special box, you don't get anything added bonus, the retail on them I think is way too high. I think your standard pair of gel maze are £100 and they went on sale racks for like 60 So they're not the most well perceived shoe. Not a lot of people like them that much and the retail on these was 140 which I just thought was extortionate. I just wanted them because I just love them and I've loved them for ages, so why not? Why not? Yeah, they're really fucking ugly, but so cool. I love them. Very nice. 